थैंक यू चेयरपर्सन मैडम जी जी फॉर अलाउिंग मी टू स्पीक ऑन दिस डिस्कशन ऑन दी सप्लीमेंट्री डिमांड्स फॉर ग्रांट्स 22 23 आई थैंक यू फॉर प्रोवाइडिंग मी द अपॉर्चुनिटी द टोटल एक्सपेंडिचर इन 22 23 वाज एस्टिमेटेड एट 39.45 लाख करोड़ इन द यूनियन बजट आवर फाइनेंस मिनिस्टर ऑन बिहाफ ऑफ आवर गवर्नमेंट सिक्स द अप्रूवल ऑफ दिस हाउस टू अथॉरिस ग्रास Uh, additional expenditure of 4.36 lakh crore the need for supplementary grant has arisen to meet the development plans and pro priorities of our government however if we see one of the main factors it is because the fertilizer subsidy burden has exceeded the budget estimates in the back if war in europe and need for need of the government to continue support additional requirements for providing food grains to our brothers and sisters madam as a rebounding effect this has impacted the oil prices in term causing the inflation level of level to rise uh, it is always the economically weakest section of our society uh, who are affected badly by this economic disruption it is hence the duty of the government to provide the population with a support system at the same time improving the macro economic parameters of our economy it is with this intention our government has sought the approval of this additional expenditure towards food subsidy food procurement and additional allocation under uh, pradhan mantri garib kalyan yojana as the approval has been uh, sought for expenditure of the ministry of petroleum and natural gas towards payment of lpg subsidies to oil marketing companies and lpg connection to the poor under pradhan mantri ujjwala yojana despite volatility volatility the indian economy has shown extreme resilience in the past few months measures have been taken by our government and the reserve bank of india as well as uh, to curb uh, domestic prices of key commodities which helped in cooling inflation if we compare consumer prices in india with that of other major economies it, is, it will be uh, clear that india is recovering at a much faster price uh, faster uh, pace than other madam uh, india has overtaken the uh, united kingdom to become the world fifth largest economy and is now behind only the us china japan germany and according to imf projection a decade back during the upa rule india india was ranked 11th among the largest economic economics it is this remarkable achievement by the nda government under the leadership of our honorable prime minister sri narendra modi ji that india has uh, got the privilege to assume the presidency of g20 that works to address major issues related to the global economy i congratulate our honorable prime minister and our finance minister for making india a strong and trusted economy uh, in the world um, according to the Uh, world bank india must continue to prioritize lowering inequality while while also putting growth oriented policies into uh, place to, to boost the economy madam <coughs> even one minute even in terms of economic growth india is projected to be the fastest growing among uh, other economics according to the im imf uh, latest world economic output report as per the a uh, report and i once again congratulate our government and our minister for this remarkable success with this i support this thank you shri kartik anand ji